Hello everyone, my name is B, and this channel is about my candle journey. Um, it's still very early stage, but I placed some orders for jars, for wax, for some wicks, and they realized that um, I need a business address, but I also want to protect my private address, so one of the requirements um, that probably didn't make sense what I just said. So basically, what we need, every candle made in UK need to have CLP label. On the CLP label, you require to have your address also. So I'm not a specialist, I have no clue um, what kind of address can I just put randomly, I don't know, um, Town I'm living in, postcode, county, is that it? Or do I need to put some more information? When I went on to Candle Shack um, website, realized that um, when you put details on CLP label for them to print it for you and send it to you, they um, they require your full address. I'm very early in my stage, so I really don't want to put my home address. So I'm trying to find out, is there any chance I can use different address? Or can I go to the post office and register a different address and everything will be directed to my address? So I'm going to have a little search about it and I will keep you informed about my findings. So I find out there is a plenty website which gives you the option. But I, another thing is that I don't want to pay massive money. I'm trying to, because it's the beginning of my journey, I don't want to spend God know how much money for fake address or for someone um, who's going to look after my um, post and stuff like that. Oh, that's the good one. I think that website is quite helpful, so I will definitely um, put a link hello for it well one of the options they're saying to have PO box so let's have a look is there any local PO box in my area I can't buy that one uh, and that 113 pound a month damn it That's a lot. Let's see what Royal May got. The post office is $39.60. I'm not sure I can have all that, but I need to put something on CLP label. Something what is true. Box. Post office seems to be the cheapest so far. Uh, let's have a look what are there. Well, there are another option is to use someone somebody else address, but I do not really have anyone. I could ask to use their address because obviously I'm putting them in risk the other people personal life um, that might sound silly for in the beginning of your business journey but if you don't have a shop and you don't have a office or you know somewhere what is separate from your private life you might be in trouble especially these days 
Royal Mail PO Box um, for now, although it costs 33 34 pounds per month, which is quite a lot, quite a lot for me at the moment because I'm trying to run on the minimum cost to be able to invest in a product. Um, but I guess without, I can't release the product without having a business address. Hope that makes sense. Okay guys, decision has been made. Um, I'm gonna go for a post office PO box. So, so we're gonna go for post office uh, PO box, and uh, but I'm not gonna apply for it yet. I just need to uh, make some candles first, design the labels. And once all this is set, that's what I'm gonna do. So my next step is going to be, um, well, I've got some products coming this week. So I will share that with you guys and do unboxing. And we go from there. So subscribe and wait for the more updates. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.